Hi everyone, welcome back for Countdown Day 10 of the Wine and Kisses Valentine Wishes from Sip and Savor Wine. So we're going to do a little bit of wine tasting. I've got some different snacks that I've never had before, so I'm excited to try those. And while we're here, we might as well do something constructive. So I've got my Look Fantastic Beauty Box. I believe this is still January's. It's a really pretty, like a kind of like a sea glass misty green so looking forward to spring so i hope that you stick around and join me Hi everyone, I'm Nancy and welcome back to my channel. This is like day 10 of the countdown to Valentine's Day with this smooch wine from the Wine and Kisses Valentine Wishes from Sip and Savor Wine. I really enjoy these theme filled boxes. Um, started, I found them by accident while just kind of looking for Christmas advent calendars last year and I saw their Halloween box and I was just hooked on their, their special theme boxes. So they was actually the ones that I got the uh, Christmas countdown um, wine advent calendar to this year. So anyway, looking forward to doing that, having some snacks that I've never had before. Sometimes when you walk down the uh, grocery aisle, just uh, something's kind of catch your eye and it's like, you know, I'm going to try that. But right now we're going to do the January, the Look Fantastic Beauty Box. I should have checked, but it will be in my description below. I believe these are like either $18 or $21 a month. And um, when I signed up, I used somebody's link. I signed up for the year. My first box was a dollar, and then every box thereafter was $16. So I've had some great products in here. Um, they're usually uh, deluxe samples, but every now and then you do get a full-sized one. And right now, they haven't stopped doing it, but so we are getting a pamphlet from them. And it tells you a little bit what's in there. It usually has a little bit of some articles in here, too. So it tells you about the items that are in here or could possibly be in here this one had a choice and then there was a bonus but it's just got some articles that you can read and just check it out so that's look fantastic it's also the sneak peek that's coming it's pixie glow tonic so i don't know what that's about but this could be in my next box so looking forward to that and so let's show you the items that i got in here so this first item is lavender tea and it's a body wash and i do love the scent of lavender especially at night time when you, you know, might have my mister on just to put have some lavender oil and it just really smells nice so having it in like um the bath products is really nice so that when you go to bed you just have that fresh scent i did take the saver up because i wanted to smell this so it's a nice kind of like a purple gel. I don't know if you can see that. But it's nice, nice scent of lavender. So just very calming, very relaxing. Going to enjoy using that. And this was in a few different boxes this month that I've seen other people get. It's this Polar. It's an Eternal Snow. And it's supposed to be a youthful cream that's supposed to help with fine lines, wrinkles, help defy by the effects of uh, aging it's got this cap on it that I didn't take off so I just did let's see what it smells like or whatever kind of kind of a floral scent but very very mild which is good if I'm going to put it on my face I don't always want a scent there but oh, I got a bruise on my hand I have no idea how that happened that's what happens when you get old your skin gets kind of like papery thin sometimes and you just whack it and you don't even know it but uh, yeah, it's just a really nice, light floral scent. So I think that's going to be nice because I am noticing these are getting a little bit more defined. So we got this. Then we got Bloom and Blossom. And this is a hand cream. And I did take the seal off this already. This has the, the I don't know how to say it, the Ylang Ylang essential oil in it. I'm just going to put that right there too. I love that scent. So it's a nice thick cream. Oh, that smells, feels nice going on. 
and it does it smells really nice it's still very light scent so it's not going to be overpowering it's going to drive me crazy now trying to figure out where that bruise came from yeah Alrighty, so there's that one. So that's going to be a good one. It's a really just a it's a that's a nice high sample. Put in your purse or put by the TV or nightstand or something. When you wake up, you just kind of feel like you need just a little bit. This is a lip plumping oil from Skin Chemist. It says rose quartz and it's got peppermint oil and mica in here. So I don't know if that's. I don't know if that peppermint's going to burn and my lips are still kind of chapped, so I'm not going to put that on. But it smells just nice and minty fresh, like a nice uh, toothpaste or mouthwash. So having that on your lips is going to kind of make you feel even fresher than you were. Uh, next, this one, there was a choice that you could have got in here. So they had black hair, shampoo, or conditioner you could have got or this Ahava mineral shampoo or conditioner. And they sent me the Ahava mineral conditioner. And I know I've got my canned cream from them and foot creams, but I've never had a hair conditioner from them. So I'm hoping this will be a nice little addition to try. And I did, this one didn't have a seal. I don't smell too much other than the yilang yilang. But anyway, looking forward to trying this conditioner. And then the last item in here is a pillow spray. And I've seen other people get this and I know other people love this. It's the Deep Sleep Pillow Spray in Lavender. So that should be really nice too. Just kind of do a fine mist on your pillow before you go to sleep. It kind of smells like pepper like lavender and pepper. I don't know, maybe it'll kind of dissipate a little bit, but so that was everything in my Look Fantastic box. Like I said, this is a monthly subscription that I get. And every now and then I think that, you know, maybe I don't need it anymore, but then I forget to cancel and now I forgot when I got it, so I don't know when my anniversary is. So we got the uh, box, little pamphlet, we got the pillow spray, the lavender tea body wash that smells really nice. This uh, anti-aging cream, forever youthful young or something to help defy my aging and help with my fine lines and wrinkles. This uh, bloom and blossom hand cream in ylang ylang, however you say it. This lip plumping oil, which I'm not sure. I don't think it's gonna hurt me, but I might try it because I am just loving using some oils. So it's got some peppermint in it. It smells nice and fresh. And this Ahava, this conditioner, so mineral conditioner. So looking forward to using that. So that was everything that was in my Look Fantastic box. Alrighty, so now, yeah, so let's get to the wine. So what I got for my treats today. So, you know, I've heard of these things, but I've never tried them. So they were in the frozen food aisle, and so I got some frozen pickles. It's a whole big jar. I just kind of grabbed out a couple. And then calamari. Now, I love fried calamari, like when we get it at uh, Italian restaurants and things like that. Not sure how good it's going to be from the frozen food section of my local supermarket. That came with this kind of tangy sauce right here that I just spilt all over myself. Use my handy dandy napkin here. So we've got these fried calamari, these deep fried frozen pickles, and I just kind of warmed them up in the air fryer and I didn't know what to put on it. So I got some Hidden Valley Ranch dressing just to use to dip those in. And the wine that we got today from the Smooch wine kisses and valentine wishes so this one is a cabernet sauvignon i don't think it's going to say too much in the back just the same as the other th ones that we've gotten this it's all grapes kissed by the california sun focus Alrighty, and i'm going to use my champagne flute oh crap a doodle i should have got my little handy dandy opener Okay, I got it. Phew, some of these are just harder than they should be. Alrighty, so this actually I got on Home Shopping Network. It was in the as-is section. Someone had returned the box um, 
one of them was broken there was only one left and of course a lot of people don't just want one but I that's all I need was one so it was a great buy for me and so it's another one that's kind of like that deep color purple it's kind of translucent but it isn't like a nice deep purple can't really swirl. Oh my gosh, I just had a little sniff. So it's going to be like the deep purpley fruits again, like um, the dark skinned grapes. You're going to have the maybe blackberry, some plum. Oh my gosh, it smells good. And I know it's going to be a little on the dry side, but that's okay with me. I used to be terrified of the tannins and things like that. And these, I just, just didn't like that going in and just that dry sensation and now I've just kind of learned that I kind of can appreciate it I know it's the stems of the grapes it's the grape skins and these tannins are the ones that and these red wines that really are good for your heart health too as long as you don't overdo it it's always going to be moderation but you know a glass they say a glass one or two glasses a night or a couple of nights a week it's really good for your heart it's good for some other things as well and it's the tannins that help do that too and it's got antioxidants in it so Cheers, everyone. Happy uh, 10th day to Valentine's Day. And so it's got a nice flavor. You got the tannins that kind of dry your mouth out at first. But as you start to swallow it, you get the acidity. And it's not like high acid, but it's a little bit. So you get kind of like your mouth watering from the fruits that are in here. It is a dry wine, but I I like that kind of sweet finish that you get when you swallow it. And it just kind of leaves your mouth with a really nice, cool sensation. So I'm going to have another sip. And then I'm, I'm, I'm a little nervous to try these dried pickles. I've never had them before. And the calamari that's from a grocery store. But anyway, cheers. Mmm, so good. Alrighty, so... I got this little tiny baby pickle right here, so we're going to dip that in the Hidden Valley Ranch. Alrighty, going to go for it. Mm. Of course, I love pickles. And of course, anything deep fried is going to be good, right? So you got that tanginess of the dill. Goes perfect, I think, with that dipping sauce. The uh, Hidden Valley Ranch. Don't know if I'm going to have as much luck with my calamari. Took one of the littlest ones here. And it came with this dipping sauce, so we'll see what it's like. It fell off my fork. Be bold, be brave. Go for the calamari. Mm. Mm. That sauce is nice. It's kind of like an orange marmalade, but it's got some zing in it. Like maybe it's mixed with something jalapeno. So good. Got some like black pepper that's a strong black pepper that's in the coating for the uh, calamari. So, so good. Alrighty, perfect little snack. So anyway, I want to thank you guys so much for stopping in, spending a few minutes of your day with me. It means more to me than I can ever let you know. My subscribers, you guys are awesome. And yeah, so thank you everyone from the bottom of my heart. If you are new to my channel, I hope you would consider hitting that little red subscribe button over there. I would love to have you come back and join me for future videos. Um, oh yeah, we need a code word because um, for every one of these videos that I'm doing in this kind of little countdown to Valentine's, um, and of course all the, the rules, which will be in the description below, are going to apply. And if you meet those and you use the code word for every video of mine that you comment on and use that code word, you go into the drawing at the end. Um, so anyway, we've already used a couple of things. How about pickle? Pickle sounds like a good word. So yeah, use pickle in a sentence someplace in the comments below. I hope that you click on like. 
more important than that. I hope that you guys go out, enjoy the weekend, um, just have fun, you know, try some kind of weird things every now and then, and just uh, have a little bit of fun with everyone. Life is hard enough, so we need to, I'm starting to get the tremor, so I think I'm going to have to close out, so thank you everyone for stopping in and, and visiting. Um, you are amazing, and um, I can't wait to see you guys again tomorrow night. Love you guys. Bye-bye.